Guys, Jed Walters here. Uh, in today's video, I'm actually going to ask you guys a question. I want you to post your comments in the box below about this as well. Um, the question is, is the target that important? Uh, is the target that important? Now, we know that golf's all about moving the ball from the tee, getting it in the hole in as few shots as possible on each of the holes that we play. But should we really spend that much time focused on the target? Personally, my opinion, I think not. I think, especially from watching a lot of the elite guys, you'll see it on the telly, you'll hear those conversations between the player and the caddy. If you go to the events, especially on the practice days, you get a lot of that information as well. They're always looking at where they want to start the golf ball. They're never thinking about the target. They're always thinking about the start direction. Those conversations from the middle of the fairway with the caddy are all about starting it at the camera tower or starting at the logo on the grandstand or anything like that. It's never about, well, there's a flag, so just start it at the flag. Or there's the middle of the fairway, start it at the middle of the fairway, get on the green, there's the hole, just hit it to the hole. It's all about start direction. And I think this is something that most golfers could really learn a lot from and really improve the quality of their golf from, the control of their golf ball. Because one thing that I find from getting somebody to aim, especially when giving lessons, the first thing that we look at is, okay, well, let's pick out a target. It's all about hitting the, to the target. So when we're hitting to the target, that feeling of swing comes a bit this way for most people. It very rarely comes in this manner here. People want to hit the golf ball dead straight. So they want to hit it from A to the target, which is B. They want to hit it straight so they feel the club's got to go vertically this way to try and hit the golf ball straight. And the reality is the shaft angle means that we've got to swing the club around us in a circular motion. So the body's got to turn, the club's got to move around in a circular motion. So for all golfers, I think you will all improve if you start to think more about start direction and less about target. So I've laid a couple of sticks on the ground here. The black one is to indicate my ball to target line. So the direct route from the golf ball to the target, as you look from down the target line view, it's sort of red and blue flags there, which are in the middle of the driving range. The green stick is start direction. This is where I'm thinking about getting the golf ball to start. In my mind, I see the ball traveling from right to left. My natural shot shape is right to left. Now, the more I play, the more I practice, the more control over the axis that the ball spins on and how much it curves. So, more I play, more to draw, less a play, it can be a bit of a hook at times too. So I want to think about, if I think about hitting it straight, the ball's just gonna go way, way, way to the left. So I focus on the start direction. I wanna see the golf ball starting right of the goal, the target, it's the goal where I want the ball to finish. I want the ball to start to the right of that. Now, for left-handed player, if it's starting to the left of it, I think you guys go out there, practice it and try it because you are gonna improve immensely from thinking about the golf ball starting in a particular direction because it's going to help the path of your golf swing. It's going to help your swing direction and your swing path. So I'm going to aim the club face where I want the ball to finish, which is on target at the flags. But my swing direction, my intention is the club to travel this way, so it's going to produce a little bit of a curve. So I'm going to take my setup. I'm going to hit a couple of shots here now. So I've got ball to target line, start direction and I'm just going to think about as I always do starting the golf ball a little bit to the right and that one is dead straight over that little gap that you've seen from down the target line between the red and the blue flags let me hit one more for you there so again <coughs> club face is squared up to the overall target the goal taking a setup but it's all about thinking of the start direction, the green stick to the right. And again, that one's in exactly the same place. So as an outcome, two perfect outcomes. Guys, get out there and practice it. If you've never done it before, do it. Exaggerate the amount of the start direction you see off to the right or for you lefties off to the left. At first, if you've never done it, you've really got to exaggerate the feeling because 
it's very difficult to think of changing it a little bit you'll be too close to where you normally are so really exaggerate it i sometimes get a, an old box with clients and i'll stick it all the way over here right in this corner here and ask them to try and hit the golf ball through the box they never get anywhere near it because it starts a fraction right a target and it's a beautiful shape of a golf shot so really think about that start direction when you're practicing put something down give you that visual to help you achieve the right direction, the right feel, and then more importantly, the right outcome, the right result. Guys, thanks for watching. As always, give it a thumbs up if you like the video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button as well. Post those comments in the box below. Love to hear your thoughts on it, whether you think about it, whether you've never thought about it. Get those comments posted in the box below. And I look forward to seeing you guys again next time. Thanks for watching.